So the first time I go to buy one, I walk in and I say to the guy, Hamba, pointing at the Roja Moor. He doesn't understand, he's like, huh? And I'm like, Hamba. He says to me, Roja Moor, Hamba, Roja Moor. <laughs> and to me, this was a very awkward and strange situation. So my question today is what other awkward and strange situations can learning Chinese bring us? Mm. Yesterday I went bungee jumping at the Great Wall when I said I don't want to go on it, but they didn't understand. And the only Chinese words I know is hello, I love you, and thank you. So I was saying all three, and they shoved me. But in the bus, they say, And I'm like, what? They say, And what is the R for? I don't understand. They were saying every time, Tim Putong, Tim Putong. And then I was just replying, I'm sorry, I don't understand. And he was replying, Tim Putong, Tim Putong. <laughs> I asked my friends, like, what does Tim Putong mean? It means you don't understand. It's like, oh, that makes sense. Oh, Richard, he's very high. And I was like, oh, I'm not very high. Just name it all, Xiaoren, Xiaoren, Xiaoren. So I thought, like, Xiaoren, like, small. I'm a teacher with children, and I was telling them just to get in line. I was seeing a tone off. So I think when it's a tone off, it's let's party. Anything with tones trips me up. Father, I'm afraid to say it because if you mispronounce it, you're not saying father, you're saying crap. We were learning the word chifan, to eat. And some of us were pronouncing the, the fun not clearly enough and became chifan, eating excrement. In the classroom, it's pretty easy to talk because the teacher always speaks really clearly. But as soon as I'm like outside, especially in Beijing, it's like either the arhua, like the accent that gets to me, or it's just like in general, I'm not ready to just be like in the wild. Nothing um, can prepare you for a taxi ride. <laughs> Nothing. So if you want to go to Stanley Tum, what do you have to say? Try and make it into one syllable if possible. I was on the subway the other day and this lady was telling me, was giving me a pamphlet. I looked at her, went down, said thank you in Chinese. And right afterwards, my friend told me she gave me a pamphlet so I could watch my weight. Mian fun, mian jin, something like that. To me, it's like only I want mian because I learned noodle as mian. No, 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 it's fun, it's fun. Why? But I do appreciate people that take the time to try to figure out what you're saying. You know, as a foreigner, you get a little bit of slack and people, you know, yeah, do their yeah. best to, to help you out. 